Hey guys, my name is Nine Rain, and I think I've rediscovered the best way to play this game. I'm getting a ton of experience, I'm making loads of money, and I'm having a blast doing new things in the game that I've never done before. It's really fucking cool. So, um, this is a little special episode of Iron Man, and I think it's gonna be a really good one. So, uh, let's get to it, baby. Uh, woohoo. You see this stick? I fucking hate this stick. I'm tired of carrying it around. This is a Draymond staff. <clears throat> it's, uh, it's really, it allows you to walk into to a circle of mushrooms and there within teleport thy body to another circle of mushrooms. But I want to do that second part of the game with the teleporting without the stick in my hand part. So translation, I need to complete my Lumberge and Drainer Elite Diaries because that's one of the rewards is I don't have to, I don't need this stick. Okay, all that's left to do is to steal from a chest, pickpocket some dude, chop a log in a really specific place, do a quest escape emote in front of an old man and deliver fat beats while wearing dragon earbuds. What the fuck is this? What the hell is that sound? Hey guys, it's Floor Nine Rain here, and this video is brought to you by Raycon. Now, now if you don't know who Raycon is, you better lie to me because they sponsored a video just a few months ago. Don't tell me you didn't watch that. I'm gonna keep this short and sweet. I really like this earbud. I use them all the time now. They have great sound quality. They're really comfortable, and they stay in your ear. I mean, like they, they really, they really get in there. They're. You couldn't get it out if you tried. They have a bunch of different gel tips, so you can fit them to your ear. And they've got 48,000 five-star ratings, which that's that's a big number. They offer eight hours of playtime with the 32-hour battery life. That's a long time. And they're about half the price of other premium brands. I'm probably gonna, gonna cut back to me uh, cutting it on the drums, if you know what I mean. Because we gotta, we gotta get that uh, diary... I, diary? What are we doing? Thanks again to Raycon for sponsoring this video. Click the link in the description box or go to buyraycon.com forward slash 9ray to get 15% off your Raycon purchase. Nah. All right, we're just gonna... Yeah, okay. I have not been down here in ages. I never come down here. Take me to the mines, Kaskar. Open door. Okay, now I gotta steal from a chest. A Dorgish Khan rich chest? Mm, is this a rich chest? Let's see. Picklock. What are they doing? Did you see those guys? Oh my god. And there it is. We did it. Uncut red topaz? Wh Wait, what? I'm making so much money and a, I got a dunce. Yeah, it's all coming up nine rain. Let's go. And room crafting. Easy game. Look at this. I'm making money. Can I pick lock this chest again? It's already been looted. Okay, I don't know what the timer is, but we made some money. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna go to a place in the game that legit nobody ever goes ever. Yo. Yo, yo, sick. Who's this? Oh, that's the guy, Moverio. What the hell is he doing? What is he shaking? We got a pendant of Lucia. Weird. Now for the next diary requirement. <laughs> Quest get a moat. And, and we did it. Lumbers and drainer area task is completed. Now I gotta go to the mage training arena. This place is cool. Chippy choppy. Come on. Come on, ch chop the... Chop the tree. Just chop it in. Chop it in. Just chop the tree. Chop the tree. Just a little, uh, little chippy choppy. We got 89 goddamn wood cutting levels. All I'm asking is a little chip, a little chop. What a. Wanna cut that log there, Nynaeve? Oh, there it is. Yes, it happened. We got it. We got the log. Now there's only one I think left to do, and it's to craft 140 or more water runes at once. I can do that. Okay, so I, I'll go get some essence. Where the hell is the water thingy? Okay, I don't even know where it is, but that doesn't matter. I'm gonna run my butt to the mage in the wild. It's gonna teleport me to that really creepy red place that nobody understands. Wait, what? I'm, I'm on a target world? <laughs> 
<laughs> I, as if anyone is actually doing bounty hunter in 2022. Okay, where the hell do I have to go? Okay, now I go water rift and craft. And we did it. We did it. You have completed all the elite tasks in the Lumberton Drainer area. Speak to Hades Kazayanus. Do I, I guess I'll just Lumberge Telly home. Perfect. Look at me go. It's, it's this guy right here. My second elite diary and one of the most important ones. <gasps> You've completed them. I can cast the high level alchemy 30 times per day with the Explorer Ring. The Culinary Manager's Chest. Wow, thanks. Let's go. 50,000 more experience on room crafting. We're 48k away from a level. That's pretty cool. And look, Lumberge and Drainer completed. Yes, two elite diaries complete. And most importantly of all, wait, where does this take me? Cabbage? Oh no. Eh, no. Okay, I gotta go to a bank. Look, fairy ring. Ready, go. Yes! I can teleport without having shit in my hands. Oh my god. Do you know how long I've wanted to do this? I have wanted to be able to do this since I like started the series two years ago or more. I am bad at RuneScape and it took me ages to get here, but <laughs> we finally did it. I don't know. Maybe to some people that's not that cool, but to me that is crazy. I've wanted to do that for so long. We would finally completed the Lumberge and Drainer Elite Diary and could now teleport using Mushroom Power power over long distances without carrying uh, this stick. But what happened next? Not even I could predict for myself. Okay, I can't believe I'm doing this, but I'm just here in this godforsaken hole in the middle of the kingdom of Karend, and I'm making blood runes. And I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know why, but it feels nice. I make good money. Look, this is 700k. It didn't take very long. It's super AFK. It feels productive. Like, I like gathering the stone. I like coming out with the big blood rune stack. My dopamine is surging, and I get it. I get it. I don't even have a diary to do. I'm not doing this for any particular reason other than I kind of like it, and I never thought I would say this, but hear me when I say this. Blood rune crafting is not rune crafting. I didn't know until today, but we should definitely not not be treating blood rune crafters and rune crafters the same. <laughs> They're not the same people. We should continue to shame rune crafters, except for Automology, just for posterity. He kind of earned his right. <laughs> but everyone else out there, runing and crafting, go fuck yourself. What a terrible idea. Why would you do that? But the blood rune crafters, you people know what's up. This shit is dope. I'm getting work done. I am being a productive member of society, kind of, <laughs> and all the while on my second monitor i'm clicking and i'm clacking and i'm getting blood runes and my number go burr and my cash tag groweth and so i don't even know where this is going in the video i don't it's there's not even a bit here this is just me <laughs> rune crafting so i guess this is what 2022 has come to <laughs> I, I don't know I, I, i'll see you in the next clip whatever i cannot believe i'm about to say this go to the blood altar Nynaeve, go right raise your hands and let the blood spill down them. I have 80 room crafting. Um I wish it didn't just tell my clan that. Um that's embarrassing. I wish nobody knew that I just got 80 room crafting. And now I've also just realized that I'm going to put it in a YouTube video so a lot of people will know that I have 80 room crafting. Um I made 10,000 blood runes. I made a little bit of money and uh I'm going to keep doing it for a little while and we'll see how that goes. It went well, but we'll come back to the room crafting shenanigans a little bit later because I also had a mission to stab this 3 headed fi five headed this multi-headed uh, piece of shit a lot of times until it died even more times wait did i just skip the poison attack what the hell was that yo i just skipped the po pb tell me that's a pb but that's like 135 that was so fast 136 i'm a god yo we hit so good i don't i have no idea where this is going in any video but i've killed hydra 975 times i'm just doing slayer and i keep getting hydra tasks and to be honest i've got no problem with building up my bank value at the moment. After the Slayer grind, I'm planning on doing some more chambers, going to corrupt a gauntlet, taking care of a few more best in slot items, maybe heading to TOB. So for now, we're 54,000 experience away from 97 Slayer, and we're just killing Hydra. <laughs> Do it. Kill the thing, Nynaeve. Kill it. Come on, one more hit. Yes. One damage. And that is kill count number 1,000. Holy shit. I've killed this boss a lot. Okay, I'm taking a break for now. I was just trying to get to 1,000. I don't want to 
to do Slayer anymore. Oh, we're close to we're close to 97 Slayer. I guess I'll probably just keep doing this task at one point. But I oh God, I'm gonna I'm gonna log out and go touch some grass. Holy cow! <gasps> hey, naive. Hey, golden gnome. <laughs> Ah, uh, yes. We'd completed our elite diary. We'd gotten 80 room crafting. We'd killed Alchemical Hydra a thousand times. We'd touched fucking grass. But now, it was time for the next step in our little adventure. To transform ourselves into the hero that would save all of Gilinor. Or whatever it is we're, we're trying to do in RuneScape. I, mm. You know what, gamers? I want to share something with you. Yo, check this out. I want to show you guys something that I have just learned is fucking great. Been playing this game for a long time. Never done this. This. Look, inspect tunnel, boom, tracks, inspect smelly mushroom. Hmm, I wonder if anything's over here. Yonder, this way, following yet again more tracks. Oh, is that a stinky mushroom? Gonna sniff that. Mm -hmm. Nothing, nothing. Oh, but a muddy patch. Oh, look at that. More tracks. Here we go. And inspect muddy patch. You see, I am hunting an herbivore, which is something that I had never done before in this game. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at that. Yoink. We kicked the shit out of that. 2200 hunter experience. Harvest herbivore. Yoink. Okay, we got we got an ear leaf and a guam leaf. That's not very good. But, guys, look. You literally just run around and keep following tracks. And you get shit tons of hunter XP. A little bit of herbivore XP. And a lot of herbs. And I'm feeling inspired. So, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep doing this. I don't know why. Does this align with any of my goals? Eh, kind of. I would like to max at some point. I think. <laughs> I, I would like to be rich and powerful. So yeah, yeah, I think it does. Joink, and we kick the shit out of this and we harvest another herbivore. And this time we got two Aventos and a Lantodine and a and a Guam. It's not very good. Okay, but we can do better next time. <clears throat> okay, and yeet. P harvest the herbivore. Harvest the herbivore and that's a hundred guys I, I i i harvested 100 of these sons of bitches look 18 snappy d's 14 torstoles 14 renar weeds we made 700k this maybe took like two hours maybe not even it's not bad this is so quick and while i've been rummaging around on fossil island that does remind me i have 99 farming but we're gonna go ahead and replant these mahogany trees i'm just gonna chop it myself i'm gonna chop this bad boy all by myself let's see how much is each one of these worth five 500 GP. I am fucking rolling in it, gamers. And dig clear. Okay. Use mahogany sapling. Yoink. Pace squirrel. 25 vanillion hops to protect my tree. On to the next one. No. No. The, the fucking the, the tree patch. No. Rake tree patch. And use mahogany sapling. And pace squirrel. I know I have 99 farming, but while I was here, I thought I might as well go ahead and get some more farming experience post 99. Maybe we get the pet. That would be cool. And have these nice mahogany logs. Logs. A very good firm log. But that reminds me, guys. I want to show you something. Look, 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 look. Here we go. Deposit logs. Boom, boom, bam. Check this out. We'll switch to the lunar spell book and look at this spell. Where the fuck is it? Nature runes. I need nature runes. Okay. I'm going to show you something that I don't know. I don't know if people know about this. And if they know about it, I don't think they know how good it is. Look in my inventory. I have 16,000 mahogany planks. That's 35 mil. And look, with the lunar spell book and 86 magic, you can has plank make i have 14,000 mahogany logs just lying around from kingdom of miscellanea and from chopping those mahogany trees boom plank make i'm taking my hands off the keyboard here's my mouse it's over here we're just gonna watch this look 90 experience boom 90 experience Boom, 90 experience, boom. I'm making about 400 GP with current prices every time my character does this. And I don't have to click again for like a minute and check this shit out, guys. I've been doing this AFK for the past like three days just cause I had a bunch of mahogany logs lying around. And look, I'm 8,000 magic experience away from 99 magic. Guys, this is the most broken thing I've ever seen. You're making money and good XP with an extremely AFK magic. Method? Holy shit, we're 15 earth runes per fucking- Oh my god, I just lost so much money. Oh fuck, um, huh. Make, make sure you have a staff for the fucking earth runes. Otherwise, life is bad. One inventory of mahogany logs is 9.5k. Now the same number of mahogany planks is 45k. Now there is a cost in runes and about a thousand coins per cast. So you need a pretty big cash stack, but it's so worth it. Anyways, I'll probably get 99 magic on stream because because I've been streaming a lot recently. Uh, if you want to know what that's like, here's a clip or something.
open, intricate pouch. What a hundred and sixty-three death root! Oh! We did it! I can catch so many spells! I can catch so many spells! The world is our oyster, gamers! No fucking way! But anyways, there's something else I want to show you guys. Speaking of really AFK awesome methods that are broken and super fun, let me introduce you to Nynaeve the Star Miner Extraordinaire. <laughs> oh, all right, this is sick. There's a Discord <laughs> called Star Miner or whatever that tells you where stars are. Dark Miner Essence Mine, World 466. Let's fucking go. And smashing click. Okay, hands are coming off the keyboard again. We're just standing here. We're just standing here. And look, soon. Uh, 48 mining experience 48 mining experience 48 mining experience I i've been playing the most afk version of runescape i've ever played in my entire life look you get these little stardust i turn these stardust in at the dwarven mine or something some at the mining guild maybe i don't fucking know and they gave me this thing called a celestial ring which gives me an invisible plus four bonus to mining on top of my plus three boost for using this special Dude, i'm mining this thing like a badass it's like i got 90 mining and i can i can walk around my room i can come all the way over here I don't know if you guys can point is i've been getting mad gains in mining xp hunter xp magic xp i'm making money we're getting stardust i'm getting uncut sapphires and life is good i haven't killed hydra in a week i haven't done slayer in a week i'm just chilling oh which by the way i think i got 97 slayer on stream so that's pretty fucking cool oh what the fuck yo I've been having a blast playing RuneScape and I'm not looking up guides. I'm just fumbling through the world, looking at my stats and looking at my bank and doing new things I've never done in the game. And then if I like it, I keep doing it. it what, a, what a thought. And by that, I mean th oh, you not, you know, <laughs> although with this outfit though. Damn, look at that mining animation. Jesus fucking Christ, this outfit. Anyways, <clears throat> chibity. Okay, and we did it. 425 Stardust from one thing? That's actually insane. This doesn't seem balanced like the rest of the game. Well, in a previous clip, I think this episode, I had 80 rune crafting. Look, I have 85. I've been playing Guardians of the Rift. We've already got the Colossal Pouch, an Abyssal Die, 300 extra pearls, and the hat. Nine Rain, please do more vids. Working on it, brother. Okay. <clears throat> Anyways, and the mini game is just awesome. I, again, I've been streaming a lot of it. You and I are on the same fucking page gamer we're in that dry fucking lagoon the dry fucking lagoon it's a ton of fun it's a great update we're making so much money from it too i've made 2.3 mil from guardians of the rift as well as another 300k from the intricate pouches we are well on our way to a one bill bank for the first time that's actually so dope i can't wait dude everyone who's at tob bank is really nice every time i come to this place people come up to me and just say nice things that they like the video good luck on the next vid good luck on the grind tob bank standards way the fuck better than grand exchange Bank standards. Who, who would have guessed it? We've done room crafting and hunter and mining and magic and slayer. And if you think that's all the gains we made this episode, you're, you're wrong because the video is still going. And I haven't even begun to tell you about how my first time at TOB is going. Having the ties. Your hardcore, your hardcore hurt me. status. Your hardcore status. It's not going to hurt me, is it? Fucking show to get over here. Okay. <laughs> More on that later. Why, hello there. It's the, uh, it's the, uh, herbivore hunting extraordinaire nine right here. While trying to feed my family some juicy boar meat, I've been, I've been thinking. These little mahogany saplings reminded me. I have a bunch of spirit tree saplings in my bank that I haven't used. Now, I need to save one of them for my house, but I don't have the construction level for it yet. But I will soon. But as you can see, nine spirit saplings. Now, if I go to travel spirit tree, boom. We don't have trees at Port Sarum, etc. House Sidious, or my house. So there's four trees that I can still plant. That's fucking dope. More teleports, baby. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go do that. Okay, that means that we need 15 monkey nuts, three monkey bars, and then if we take the pestle and mortar, hey, we can grind up three suqua tooths. Teeth? Three suqua teeth? I can give these to the gardeners and they'll protect my spirit tree saplings so they grow. Now, where the hell don't we have spirit trees? Port Sarum. No way. No way I don't have a 
Gold Spirit Tree at Port Sarum. Wait, what? Check health. Oh my god. 20,000 experience. We've already planted the spirit tree. He's grown. Thank you, Frizzy Skurnip. That's a suspicious name if I've ever seen one. Yo, if you're not keeping up with your kingdom of miscellanea, what the fuck are you doing with your life? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I have so much coal and so many mahogany logs from this. I can like max my smithing and construction just from AFK grinds. I mean, it takes a lot of GP, so a little more difficult on an actual Iron Man, but <laughs> you know, we do what we do here. Is the tree over this way? Rake spirit tree patch. Okay, yes. Plant the spirit tree. Pay Yulf Squeks. Yes. Pay the gnome. Let's fuck can go. All right, yeah, let's go to Hosidius and we'll go see where this thing is. Where the fuck is the spirit tree? Hello, spirit tree. Show yourself spirit tree. Spirit tree. Over by the Forthos ruins? Is this even useful though? Cross stepping stone. Oh my god, I forgot about my snape grass. I remember when I was doing a bunch of farming back in the day. That was the best fucking episode of my life. It was so fun. Okay, rake spirit tree patch. I don't know that I'll ever remember that this place was here, but boom, boom, bang. We got a spirit tree. Lammy Langle. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, protect my crop. We've done it. We planted the spirit trees. At 95 construction, we can make a spirit tree and fairy ring. Holy shit. Well, maybe with those 15,000 mahogany planks, I'll be able to get the construction levels for that. Probably. Hope so. Who knows? Back to herbivore for me. Come to me, pet herbivore. No? Okay. I have captured, harvested, excuse me, 250 herbivore. We're 49,000 experience away from 89 hunter and then guys a goal that i have been working towards for so long look redward bird redward redward redwood birdhouse trap that's gonna be sick i hope i don't really know how much better redwood birdhouses are than magic but by god i hope they're like way fucking better because i have been trying to get redwood birdhouses for like a year and a half or longer i don't know like since i started playing the game when i started playing the game everyone was like you need better birdhouses you need to do your farm runs and i was like sick man ha oh, i'm gonna get redwood birdhouse it's gonna be so straightforward and easy ha oh. and then uh here we are like 2000 total level later and three years later and we're just about to get it um you'll also notice <laughs> i have 99 magic did that on stream it was very straightforward and not weird at all five i clicked it we did it 99 fucking magic baby let's go and so the herb, the herbivore beast is at it again. I guess I'll see you guys when I have 89 hunter and boom, 89 hunter harvest herbivore and get the pet. Nope. Okay. Well, uh, time to go do my first run with the redwood birdhouses. That's pretty dope. And boom, wood cutting guild. Yes. Wait, can I even cut redwood? No, no, no. 86 to 90. That's not even close. Wait, I wonder though. I'm in the woodcutting guild. Isn't there a plus one? So it's 87. And then special attack. 89 and the plus one. It didn't, it didn't work. Shit. It's an invisible boost. God damn it. I have to go buy my own redwood logs. I was gonna chop all my own redwood logs. Oh, by the way, for those of you that are new here, this is Iron Man. <laughs> and, and if you're still watching at this point, dear God, you must really like this episode and <laughs> then you you're gonna want to watch all the other ones. <clears throat> Anyways, it's basically a main account, except everything in the boss Razor Slayer collection log is off limits until I've earned it myself. When it comes to skilling, I try and play this game like an Iron Man because it's really rewarding. And that's why I have videos like this on a main account where I'm doing a bunch of Iron Man activities. But you know, sometimes we make an exception and we just buy all the logs on the Grand Exchange. And the first birdhouse, boom, that looks, I mean, to be honest, <laughs> the magic looks cooler and you'd think it would be cooler because it's a magic tree, but I guess they made red would later so it's like higher level i wonder how much experience we're gonna get per instead of 1140 i hope it's like 2000 per that would be cool uh there we go we got the we got the birdhouses now only 500,000 experience till 90 hunter holy shit yeah i think i've done enough hunter for a while i think i had a good time and i think we're done doing herbivore and i'm not gonna it might be a little while before i come back to it but like i mentioned the series is kind of about killing shit to get really powerful items and so I've been training to defeat the theater of blood so I can get all of these shiny but magical powerful things and it's going really well. Wait, is this your first? This is not your first KC on this account. Absolutely is. <gasps> I'm honored. 
Uh, we haven't gotten it yet. I don't mean to alarm you, but there's a fucking tornado. Okay, everybody say it together with me now. I will receive the purples I deserve today. I will receive, I will the, receive purples. the purples <laughs> I deserve, I deserve today. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got a vile of blood, new collection log on. Let's fucking go. Dude, Huge for the account. Scary. Huge. The content creator diff has failed. We are all dead. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Dang me. I've just, just I've just I wiped Sujin. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I lived because I double ate like a real PK here. Sujin. The white wolf. The white wolf of Tom. Aru. Aru. Oh hey Sujin. Hey, what's up? You come here often. Yeah. See, that's funnier now after I got you killed. Yeah. He <laughs> <laughs> haha. Hey Sujin. Can you come here often? <laughs> that's a good bit. You should you should keep that. Oh, the white wolf baby, let's go. Did you just say I'm the white wolf baby? Let's go. What? <laughs> Well, when you say it like that, <laughs> it sounds silly. <laughs> Did you just say? Hey, Sujin. <laughs> yeah. You come here often? <laughs> I hate this bit. <laughs> what? No, what did you say? Do you come here often? Hey! Hey. Oh, wait. We did it. Done. Yeah. Yo, final hit, nine rain, baby. Let's go. Stupid right. fat fuck, right. flappy bitch. Right. Sorry. <laughs> and we made 126k. Let's fucking go. Oh, and we MVP. Yeah. We'll never know who it was. All right, let's go. Let's go. Haha, <laughs> it could be anyone. <laughs> and so my Iron Maiden journey continues to get all of the best loot by earning it myself and to have a good time playing this game. Because if you're not having fun playing the game, don't. Uh, play it. <laughs> Anyways, if you're watching this on the day I upload it, I'm also live right now, which you probably already knew because I am streaming on YouTube. Come say hi and I'll see you in the next video.